Good morning, everyone. Welcome to this episode in Dinkum. We're going to do our usual morning. No, get back. Becky. No, 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 no. Get back in your cage. So today we're going to do a little bit of messing around. We are as usual. So we are on now on the official holiday update, which didn't take very long. I know last episode we were just in the test branch, but I knew that there wasn't going to be any issues with that branch. Yeah, so we still have our cherry trees and everything, so that's okay. So we're getting almost to the point of the game where it's like, you kind of have everything, and now you're just kind of like struggling. Well, what do we could do? Well, we could do like tons of things, actually. Uh, we could continue building our roads and, and whatnot. I always had this idea to build a, uh, like a dirt bike track, and we still have to get our helicopter. I think we have the money for the helicopter. And there's a few things that we still haven't gotten from our NPCs. So a few blueprints that we still do not have yet. What are you doing? You dancing? Oh, he's jogging on the spot. <laughs> Weird. So I want to build like kind of a helicopter pad. When I do the, get the helicopter, I can just... Now, where I'm going to put it, I have no idea. I was thinking I was going to put it right here. That's like one spot, but I didn't want to put too much industrial kind of stuff here. And I kind of want to have all my industrial stuff to be kind of out of sight. So I'm going to go and do a little bit of hunting around to see where a good spot to put my helicopter pad. I want to be kind of close by. Also rearranged all my inventories here as well. So all my inventory is actually right here now. And if I need something, it's accessible. Mind you, I have to like kind of like do it like a little jump in and open or whatever, but there's still lots of space here. Oh yeah, I did also forget from last episode, um, we did get some special items. So I got this candy cane and this, this ax right here. So obviously I got a weapon Ooh, and it, it jingles. And jingles a little bit. I don't know what uh, kind of level that is. If that's like kind of a like more like a copper axe or something like that. I haven't tested it out because what's the point? I got a chainsaw. I don't. <laughs> I really don't need an axe. But that's kind of nice to have those like kind of different items. All right, it's raining today. I think today we are going to we're gonna go see Jimmy. Got a few things we could turn in, make some money. The money making day, I think. Because that helicopter ain't going to be cheap. <laughs> it's going to be super expensive. And it is like one of the, probably one of the last biggest vehicles that we got. Where is he? There he is. He's not too far away. And with our brewing thing here, our brewing stand, that's where we're going to make the cash. Okay, so let's see here. We got about, oh, I'm like totally six short on that one. We only want to give them groups of 50. Is that gold paint? Oh, it's totally gold paint. I'm buying that gold paint. Let's sell her away. 3,248,438 dinks. Yeah, I'll take it. Cha-ching. Sir, you just paid for my for my new helicopter. But first, I'm going to go and drop it off in the bank first. Because that'll help me with a new milestone. All right, let's just deposit this. All right, that might have gave us filthy stinking rich. All right, gave us another one. <laughs> another one. That's why I don't just convert them all right away either 10 million is the maximum i guess all right and let's go over and talk to franklin and see how much that helicopter is going to cost let's track the recipe because i probably probably have all this stuff not all my license points have been unlocked yet but i got 29,325 license points so i want to apply for a license and let's see vehicle license so that's the last one let's get this one too so we can make more money and to a belt. There isn't any possibly anything anymore I can unlock. Ah, it's closed. No, good day to you, jerk. Can't buy that helicopter from you. Guess he does not want three million dinks. Don't waste my dime. Yeah, jerk. You're a rich man, but I'm richer. <laughs> okay, the, today's the day. All right, give me my Nordic thing. This is what I really want. Oh, yes. And I also finished the helipad, too. Slop that right there. Look at that. Not super fancy. All right. So, how does this thing work? Yeah. That's how I figured. Jump button for up. How did we get down? 
Oh, I did not want to do that. Okay. Oh, this thing actually just flies too. It's beautiful. It's fast. Never gotten a helicopter before. This is the first time. I don't think there's a single spot on this island I haven't been on yet. It looks like we could load up on the back of this too. So if we found a fossil or something, we could throw it on the back. Oh yeah, this would be really good to uh, pick up those eggs during the spring as well. All right, let's just paint this up just a little bit here. There we go, blue. All right, everyone, I'm going to actually start on our dirt track and I want to have this start right about, I think right about here. So I'm gonna have to clear out a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna have to make really sure um, don't blow these things out. I went through already two dirt printers already. I had to make like two of those. So I kind of don't want to have to do that again because you know, that's awful. Having to like basically make it like, that's not a cheap item to go through basically. So yeah, I got um, different path blocks here. So I got the regular old rock path and then the rock edge path. I think I'm gonna primarily use the, the edge one as our track. Not gonna be super huge, but I want it to be big enough and substantial. I kind of want to put like a uh, bleachers right here. Oh boy, this is gonna be quite the undertaking. Though to, it is a lot of repetitive work and I want to make this as rustic as possible as well. So this will be the main starting area right about here. All right, good morning. We're gonna have a little bit of a tour. I finally finished that, this racetrack. I'm gonna show you where it starts and where it ends. So here it is where it starts. I even put in a little bit of a, uh, a seating area. But we can just like kind of like chill out, watch it. Not like you're gonna see much. You're just gonna see the finish line anyway. I'm gonna go right down this canyon. Just kind of go around up here. And I tried to like not, uh, destroy my quarries if I could. I kind of like built around it. It goes here and then it kind of like loops underneath here. And they did put a, quite a few trees go through and then there's like a big jump right off here. So let's just take a little drive on it. I love how narrow it is. I did have to actually build this up a little bit because I kept on having these uh, big birds coming over here and messing my day up. But hopefully they don't get onto the track. Just another hazard anyway. And this right here is going to be a little bit tricky, which is nice. Not just so an obvious straight path in. There is going to be some obstacles and whatnot. You can get right underneath that bridge. Lots of sharp corners here. So it's a little bit trickier. And then right off there and then right to the finish line. Okay, that should do it for this week's episode. We're going to take a little bit of a uh, Christmas break for now. And I do have a hankering to play some more games, different games this next month. And hopefully we'll get some more updates so we can do a little bit more building. There's only so much I can do for our, before I'm like, nah, I can't do anymore. <laughs> and I still really like this game. I just don't want to, uh, I don't want to get burnt out on this game, basically. So that should be it for this uh, week's episode. Hopefully we'll see you in the next one. We'll have all the uh, Christmas decorations off and hopefully we'll be ready for the next uh, update. Uh, probably won't be for, I'm thinking probably about a month and a half is probably going to be the next update is my guess. I will hop on it as quickly as I can. And hopefully some of my other games that I like to play will get updated. So hopefully we'll see you in the next one. And everyone take care. All right. Laters.